so welcome back many have not many some have uh, asked me to do a tutorial on, on beyond the buzzers effects in photoshop so today i will show you how to do uh, to have that effect so for example i took this picture we will start photoshop i have adobe photoshop cs6 so this is really simple you can do it in about one minute thirty seconds or so so I'm gonna show you how to do it for example here I put the picture now you go to filter stylize and diffuse and you go anti any sort tropic style and you will already see the difference now you go to image adjustments HDR toning you can go smooth edges and first thing you do is go detail level as you can see I am deciding what detail level I want but you can go I will go all the way to the right and now I'm Rate and now I'm doing this strength part, moving left and forward to see how I feel would feel I feel would be the best. Now radius a little bit to the right. Okay, so I did. Now gamma go one point. I can go. 1.2.04 to left exposure I will go minus 0.45 now I will shadow this all the way to minus 100 now highlight I will go some way the right plus plus 33 or, or plus 26 whatever you feel you think is the best now vibrant I will go again plus 50 plus 73 or less plus 60 now saturation you can do whatever you feel like I will go a little bit behind minus 3 so yeah there you go this is kind of all you think you have to do and if you want to single out only your player or ma or more players you go to layer you will not this you will go right click duplicate layer now you are editing this now you go here pen tool and you start going on the lines as you will see I'm going fast so you can take your time with this you can make it perfect then how you like I'm going fast with this to not make a video long so all you have to do is go if you make a mistake you can go to edit and step backward and you can do it again now this isn't going to be like really great because I am trying to make this video short so yeah I am doing this like I said it's really easy if you want anyone can do it I just know how to do this on Photoshop I don't know on other programs how you do this but yeah I chose Derrick Rose in this picture because I'm a Chicago Bulls fan so yeah
even though Rose didn't play. I hope he will be back next year even better. So yeah, just going by the lines of his leg. Now I can if you have like this part here also you have to do this so I will do this quick no matter You can go quick like this. This is how I do this. Just go and fill this lines. And now just do this and you go make selection you leave this everything here now and you click OK now you go to the bottom right here and click add layer mask as you can see it has added now as you see this part is missing right here it's no pro it's okay you can just uncheck this and go to back to layer 1 and go again duplicate layer now you edit this layer and you see where this part is missing so it's missing here and you can go all the way to the part where it's missing and just do this again like I said that's only when you have like this type of pictures where you have something in between the lines like with inner lines and you go again make selections ok and then go again add layer mask so we have this so we turn on this and there, there we go you I uncheck everything here you go this is the part which I cut out that was missing and this is the part where it doesn't have this part so yeah here is the picture and then you uncheck both of these which you cut out and you can go to hue saturation colorize like for example choose red or you don't even have to choose red. Uh, let's see how green looks like. So yeah, you can make it any way you want. And now you check these parts that you cut off right here. And here you go. That's all from me for today. Sorry if you couldn't really understand, but just follow these steps just follow it on photoshop just follow where i click you don't even have to listen to me because i can't explain it really good so yeah see you next time